Welcome back, guys. We are doing it again. I think, was it, 12 in a row? I need to get a counter. We're playing Knockout City. Um, oh, yeah, baby. You I just felt like playing Knockout City. I don't know. How we doing? Keep it's also an Ask Me Anything, so play. feel free to ask me anything. To the rest. Let's see here. Open the menu and select play to explore these new playlists. Good luck. Street rank. League play, huh? Let's see. If anyone wants to play with me, you're more than welcome. Of course. I'm on PS5, but I think this is cross-platform. <laughs> What's up, Aiden? Uh, the Cowboys missing the playoffs. Uh, their fans are going to be bummed. But I agree with you. I think the Cowboys are going to miss the playoffs. Let's get to it. Let's see how this stream goes. I know we're going a little bit early tonight, but mainly because I need my sleep. I can't stay up like till 2 a.m. Team KO. Round one. Knock out more opponents than what the, the other hell? team to win. Oh, Blue team takes dude at a bomb. This game is really fun, though. I definitely dig it. Fast paced. It's got like this casual vibe to it. I'm sure it wouldn't it if I was playing League, but. I definitely caught that. That was lame. My team's getting decimated. I think it was Scoot or Scott. <laughs> Scoot. Um, that told me that the. Um, what was it? The. Oh boy. The, I can't even talk. I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> He was telling me that the, um, I don't know, the glider is, a, is slow and it doesn't work well. And I agree with him. Oh, boy. No, don't go down. Oh, boy. Oh, that was awful. I'm playing like crap. Hey, goal team is catching up. Come on. All right, here we go. We got this. It's now tied up. Oh, not catching that. Jeez. Blue team takes the lead. Who knew playing dodgeball in a video game could be so much fun? I feel like my teammates Round just keep four. running into me. Blue team. Oh, wow. Blue what a rocket. Wins. 
Not, not the best. Not the best. Round two. I think it might be because sometimes when I'm in a gaming live stream, the person is playing plays like they never picked up a control before. I think I'm cursed. Blue team takes the lead. Oh. What? Oh, come on. It's all tied up. Oh, fell off. Hey. Gold team takes the lead. Hey, double ah. Uh. <laughs> I'm done shaking the controller, dude. I don't even know if I'm going to continue the playthrough. After last night, I don't know. Where is he? It's all tied up. Blue team takes the lead. There's no way that person didn't get hit. No way. God. Ah. Uh. Ah, uh, no, RuneScape is not my thing. My guy, uh, Jake Evans, plays it, though. You should definitely check out his stream if you're interested in watching RuneScape. Oh, come on. Come on now. This will be over before I spawn. What a bummer. So Aiden, what's good? I just looked up RuneScape on YouTube and the song What's Poppin' by Jack Harlow popped up. <laughs> I don't know. 
Not sure what's going on there. That's good. We're moving the AJ show to Sunday in Got case you didn't know. For you. Looks like a brand new brawl is brewing down in KO City. Sniper ball. All right. Team KO. Round one. What is happening? There we go. Gold team takes the lead. Pass to me. 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 Get your own ball. Oh. It's all tied up. What's up, Ebony? Um Oh, thanks for subscribing. Wait. The AJ show. Yeah. <laughs> I guess Adam's watching. Um Do you think our starting four linebacker? Who do you think your starting four linebackers will be? Um, good question. So the way I see it is, it's pro wow. That was how the hell did he not dodge that? Oh, uh, the way I see it, it's gonna be Leonard Floyd. Um, I think they want Terrell Lewis to be the starter, but we'll see. A lot of question mark there. Um, and then, wow, what the hell just happened? Um, and then Traven Howard and Ernest Jones at inside linebacker. I definitely caught that. Team takes the lead. I think so. I think he just went on and just subscribed. He must be in the channel. Show yourself, Adam. I'm also not playing heavy rain. I really got to get better at this. takes the lead what hey it's all tied up No way. Blue team needs one more point to win the round. <laughs> oh, come on. Damn it. This is such an interesting map.
Gold team takes the lead. What the hell? What kind of throw is that? Hey, there we go. I got behind the thing and he hit me. That's funny. Oh. Thinking land is gonna blow it. Oh my god, I tried to catch that. That was a rocket. Gotta love that curve. Ah. Blue team takes the lead. Blue team needs one more point to win the match. There we go. There we go. Come on. What was I doing there? All right, we got... Nice. Barely won that. Now we move to round three. Final round. Get out of here. No. Oh my god. Takes the lead. I better not have counted as his kill. What's up, Kellen? How we doing? Oh, never saw that coming. It's all tied up. Gold team takes the lead. Oh. So annoying. It's all tied up. Go 
Oh, I went to get the ball and I got sucked up into that thing. I can't believe I just did that. What kind of music do I listen to? Um, so I listen to everything in a sense, but what do I prefer? Rock, metal, pop punk, punk rock, metal core, uh, classic rock. Yeah, that's pretty much what I prefer. Huh, <laughs> you got in the way. Oh, he's annoying. Oh my god. Blue team takes the lead. So how are you guys doing? Blue team needs one more point to win the match. How was your uh what was it, Wednesday? Yeah, tomorrow's Thursday. Yeah, how was your Wednesday? Blue team wins. Why did I lose to the guy from Jerry's game? What's up, Shay TV? How we doing? What comment, Kellen? <laughs> oh, there's variations of that. Oh, I have one cred. Okay. All right. All right. Kind of like that. Okay, so I unlocked some stuff. Um, hmm. It's a YouTube who makes NFL meme videos. I told him to make a compilation of every Deshaun Kaiser win. All is well, Shay. All is well. Well, takes the lead. as well as it can be. We'll say that. in this lobby. Oh! I wanted to see if I could actually get hit.
What? Oh my god. Blue team needs one more point to win the match. Oh my god. Oh. What's up, David? How we doing? That's good. Glad to hear it. <clears throat> Everyone's enjoying their night. That's what I want to hear. See what's next. What do you guys want to watch? Is this fun? Oh, sorry to hear that, Aiden. Do I what, David? City Pirate Radio, playing the hits and calling the shots of another throwdown in the big city. All right, let's get a win. Oh. I got you. Do you, Jake? Okay. It's funny. It sounds like it's in the middle of a question. Oh, come on. Goal team takes the lead. That is annoying. Let's go. Oh, tell me you guys saw that. That was pretty cool. Oh, come on. Blue team is falling way behind. How have I not knocked one person? I don't understand that. Like. Sheesh.
Oh, come on. Oh, my God. So annoying. I find it really surprising I didn't get one knock on that. All right. Well. There you go. You're done. Wow, that homing bomb one is obnoxious. Oh, yeah, I hate everything. So annoying. To win the round. Yeah, I like the game, but I don't know. Tonight, I guess I just don't have it for this game anyway. Or they just keep putting me on the worst game, uh, worst teams. I don't know. Gold team wins. I mean, it's not like my team is any good. I didn't see 10-3 to 3 at all last night. Yeah, I did. What's up, Ashton? How we doing? Oh, come on. Damn it. It's all tied up. Oh, you're so annoying. Oh, come on. This is a good game though, eight eight. Blue team needs one more point to win the round. Yeah, let's go. Not bad turnaround from down 10 to 4 or whatever, 10 to 3. Final round. Final round. 
Feel free to ask question, guys. This is uh, ask me anything. That's what AMA means, so. Oh my god. Yes. Blue team takes the lead. There's no way. No way. No way. Ah, boy. Down 7-5. Not looking good. Oh, my God. I might play some Warzone if anybody wants to watch that. I feel like that might be more appealing. Seems like people are iffy on Knockout City. It's fun, but I understand if it's not the most physically appealing game. Or visually appealing, that's what I meant to say. So annoying. Okay, so let's, uh, where is it? Let's play some Warzone. Is that not? Hmm. I don't know how that got changed, but it did. Let's see. <clears throat> 
<clears throat> yeah, I think we're gonna play some Warzone. Ooh, cool, double XP. All right, let's do this. You hear that sound? That's Fallout. You guys know what I'm talking about. Definitely a Fallout sound there. What's up, JP? What's up, Ashton? Um, I'm good. You know, just, you know, hanging in here and live streaming. I <clears throat> hope you guys are enjoying the stream and I uh, hope you guys enjoyed uh, the Terrell Burgess video if you uh, saw it. Oh, nice. I can never play in a Rocket League tournament. Just not good enough. <laughs> Early on, when the game first came out, I was really good, and now I just am not. I don't like this gun at all. Wow. Okay. <clears throat> OTAs, uh, I mean, sadly, there's not a ton to take away. Um, it's exciting, obviously, to see Cooper Cup and Van Jefferson catching passes from Matthew Stafford, but, you know, there's just not really a ton to take away from it at the moment. Oh, Warzone solos give me a ton of anxiety. It's not like I'm immune to it. I just, uh, I don't know. It's fun. I like playing as Rambo, too. Do you guys see when I landed at Array and then got that uh, Rambo kill? I was so sick. This is going to be tough, though. I think a lot of people are... Uh, We'll uh what we'll go to a ray, right? Yeah man, thank you. Oh crap. Primary objective is to kill them all. That's not what I wanted to do.
I'm surprised more people don't land here. Famous last words. Why do I hear it? Is it on the roof? No, it's in that room I couldn't get to for whatever reason. I'm still very rusty at Warzone. I only played that one game. That was the first time I played in like a year. So we'll see. We'll see. I hurt somebody. Let's stick with this, man. Just closing in. I'm already in the circle. Damn it. Ah, uh, I saw that guy dead and I knew it. What the hell? Mason, the numbers. I don't even recognize this gulag. Here we go. Time to earn your freedom, soldier. That was weird. I hit them like repeatedly and it wasn't registering. I gotta like move back. This 120 frames just totally gets you dizzy, you know? Oh, crap. Yeah, damn. Way back.
Oh, crap. That same... Oh, I hate that guy. So annoying. The same guy killed me twice. Oh, it's so annoying. I'm just ready to get into another game. <laughs> you like Nick? I played the other day, came in eighth, but I hadn't played in like a year or so. You know, like I said, I'm still a little rusty, but yeah. I also feel like my chair, someone like adjusted my chair. I don't know who because no one's been down here, but yeah, it definitely was adjusted. <laughs> Going for the long shot. Oh, my God. actually missed. Well, it's the bullet drop, I guess. I definitely hear you, Nick. Definitely hear you. Hmm. I always land at this one spot, like right outside of Boneyard. And I hadn't land there in a minute. And that's probably my issue. I don't know why no one, like, lands here. Like, maybe once in a while they do, but...
Guy already has a UAV. Oh, this is way out here. Damn it! Why? Back to back times, it's uh, the guy's just camping there. Like, are you kidding me? Ugh. Oh. Man, that pisses me off. Like, move around, you loser. I don't know why people, like, camp in Call of Duty. I'll never understand it. Thank you, T-Wild, for subscribing. Appreciate you. Pisses me off. You win this fight and you return to the front line. But if you lose, you're done here. You're back to the front line. You it. I don't know what just happened. I think the guy just quit. I just don't know why. Like you're that scared. Like it's not like you're gonna die in real life if you die in this game. Really? I don't even care. I'm making my mission to go after this guy now. Can you cut, please? Come on. We lost that one, but we'll come uh, back next time. So annoyed. I almost broke his armor just with the pistol. Yeah. I shouldn't have done that. I, I let my emotions get the best of me. I was just like, you know what? That dude's trying to shoot me out of the sky. No. No, I don't play that. Would love to know why my videos default as uh, not monetized. Like, it's so annoying. If you guys ever, like, upload YouTube videos and you get monetized, it's so, so annoying how much it'll just be like, yeah, you want to get monetized? Let's uh, make the default so you don't get monetized. Like, I can't tell you how much I hate that. It's so annoying. Like, stop doing that. So for my Rams fans that are in this channel, if you guys don't already know, tomorrow at 8 p.m. Eastern time, I'll have Blaine Grisak, managing editor of Downtown Rams. He will be coming on the JE Live show, and we will be discussing Rams uh, centrically. So if you guys are interested in that type of content, be sure to set your alarm for the 8 o'clock Eastern time. So it'll be 5 o'clock uh, West Coast, or rather Rams time. Uh, if you you guys want to check that out. Next week, I have Mike Hernishan from Blue Chip Scouting coming on. We're going to talk some NFL, as well as uh, Patrick Chiotti of Pigskin Nut Football and Zach Sagers uh, from Mile High Sports and a bunch of others that are um, on the way. God, who switched the cut parachute to the uh, stick? It's so annoying.
What's up, Nick? Or Nicholas, sorry. Um, yeah, so I think the Rams are going to use 2-2 all different ways. Don't be surprised if he's used a little bit as a running... Uh, at, a little bit as a running back out of the backfield. I can't even talk. Um, and using the slot and used on the outside and used to stretch the field and, you know, what have you, you know. I, I think the the Rams, the possibilities are really endless on how to use a guy like 2-2 Atwell when you look at that explosive ability and his, you know, contact balance is pretty good for his overall stature. So, yeah, that's what I would say. Oh. <sighs> Summit, huh? All right, let's see what we got now. Same spot in my landing. Hmm. Don't know what to do. Damn. Okay, so. Clear to engage all targets. Didn't give me much. hear him I might just go upstairs oh come on man damn it what's up Gimlet So goddamn annoying, man. This is not my night. I got anger, man. I don't care who you are. I'm Rambo, so I would destroy you by virtue. Scott, how we doing? I love how, you know, it takes a magnum shot to the head to break somebody's armor. Like, come on. That's where Warzone just kind of like, I don't know. Not to be too realistic. You can't have them die like how they would, but. What the hell? Oh my god. Yeah, I don't know why. Alright, we're not playing that. I can't. The, tonight is not my night, and I'm not going to continue to upset myself playing that. Um, okay. So we played Knockout City a little bit. We played... War zone. Anybody have any requests? I'm going to try to figure out what to play.
I'm trying. Let's see here. I don't want to play any story game because I'm not going to be playing for that much longer. I think I'll stop at 11. Valhalla. I don't really like the game that much, to be honest with you. Probably beat it at some point, but it, it's just like a chore to me. You know what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't really enjoy it. Huh. Huh. <sighs> Stranded Deep. I've never played that before. Hmm. What to play, what to play, what to play. I could probably play some Miles Morales if it was installed. What's up, Ram's house? How we doing? Hmm. I wonder how long it would take to copy this thing. I got to I got to put up space, but I wonder how this process will go. I'm trying to swap control out for Madden. Although I think Madden is going to be more than what I can do. Yeah, I think I might play Madden. I don't know. Not too bad, Ram's house. Not too bad. I just don't know how long this... Crap. I almost dropped my controller and then did that. I just don't know how long it's going to take, you know? If I can get it done quickly, I'll do it, but I don't want to hold up the stream. The channel's growing, though. We're almost at uh, 5,000. That's a goal that we set, so... You know, I'd love to be at 5,000 subs soon. Um, the goal is 20,000 by the end of the year. I know it sounds crazy considering we have not even 5,000 in June, but I know we'll get there because the NFL season is going to come, and I think that's when we're going to be able to really thrive. I can't wait to see it. I'm thinking I'm going to walk you guys through it for those of you who are being patient in here because I understand I'm not gaming um so the way I th I'm thinking about it thanks Ashton appreciate you the way I'm thinking about it is we're going to it's going to be an extension of everything that I'm thinking during the season so I'm going to try to have NFL content of course um I will be covering the Rams uh for downtown Rams but I think also for this channel I think um, you guys have been overwhelming in your support of me as far as the Rams, you know, goes. And so I think we'll continue that, um, you know, as a focal point of the, the channel, um, with NFL, of course, being sprinkled in there. So my thoughts and my plans are that each week of the NFL season, um, I want to do a video recapping the week, my thoughts, maybe do a, you know, a Jake's thoughts of the week or something like that. So we'll do a video for that. 
and then we'll do a video um, pregame for the Rams. So we'll do a stream pregame postgame. This is my plan. So pregame postgame for the Rams. And then uh, during the week, I'll do any updates, injuries, anything like that. We'll do videos and uh, we'll do a video on recapping the rest of the week uh, for the NFL and just, you know, lather, rinse, repeat. Um, and I'll be making, you know, those those film videos as well when I can. So I think that's going to be the pattern I go with. Um, you guys are not ready for the content you're going to get. You're going to get a lot of content. Um, it's going to be a ton of NFL stuff, a ton of Ram stuff. Um, the streaming, because of that, I don't know how many games I'm going to be streaming and how much I'll be streaming gaming um, because it just simply doesn't do as well as any of my Rams videos. Um, but I will continue doing it. I just don't know if I'll be able to do every night like I'm doing right now. Um, yeah, that's a great point, Ashton. I'm excited. See, like, if you guys remember, I started at the end of the 2020 NFL season and I kind of had my... I didn't really know what to do. And I mean, I can go through, you know, I, I can go through it with you. I mean, I, if you look at my channel, it's not really organized at the beginning, it gets more organized, uh, you know, near the current. And so, you know, when you look at my content early on, it's like, I think I did a video on Fox. Okay, cool. Now we'll get Madden in there. If we can. <laughs> One second. <sighs> oh my god, what? How much space is Madden taking up? Yeah, we're going to move Avengers. Okay, so while we move Avengers... I got jump scared on War Warzone watching your video. That's funny. I pretty much did too, playing my video. But so yeah, guys, um, if you look back at my first videos, we'll go over them. So the first one is Fox Sports does not care uh, that the Rams beat the Seahawks. Now, I uh, apparently I made that November 17th. I actually was on a run where I did that. And then the next day I came out with LaMelo Ball is the star. You can't afford to pass on the NBA draft that aged like fine wine. Uh, Colin Coward is right about the Giants winning the NFC East. That didn't uh, <laughs> that definitely didn't age as well as I wanted it to. And then the next video. Um, wow, we went four straight days with the video. Saints are making a huge mistake starting Taysom Hill over Jameis Winston. So as you can see, guys, I was really, I dipped my toe into a territory I wasn't familiar with, and I just talked about things that were simply on my mind, you know? Didn't really have a, a plan of attack, didn't really, um, what's the word I'm looking for? It wasn't really organized, just kind of spontaneously made videos when I wanted to make videos. LA Rams are the team to beat in the NFC West. Yeah, they are. So I did that, and I did the NFL DFS FanDuel Week 11 lineup. That didn't really do well. Um, Joe Nopum's every snap from the Rams-Seahawks game. That did all right. NFL Elite 4, Steelers, Chiefs, Saints, Rams. That didn't age all that well, but did well for the most part. Um, NFL DFS FanDuel, Thanksgiving edition. 
didn't do that well for the amount of work I put into it. Um, NFL screws the Broncos for having COVID uh, or for having COVID under control. That didn't do that well. Jared Goff, what the hell happened to? I, I don't know what the hell happened to Jared Goff. Um, so I actually this ended up. Well, and, and I think it will over time. Like, I think Lions fans will bore in and, you know, it'll have a shot at 10K. Um, it finished at, like, 9.5K uh, views. Um, so that did really well. And then I I did who is the GOAT. Uh, Aaron Rodgers is the GOAT, not Tom Brady. That did uh, not as good as I expected, but all right. Um, then we moved on. Gardner Minshew is the most underrated um, quarterback in the NFL that did pretty well. Eagles have proven quarterback insurance have proven quarterback insurance is a must. Uh, that did all right. The John Wolford is the LA Rams new hope absolutely shattered everything. And I think that is when my channel found direction because up to that point, I wasn't sure what I wanted my channel to be. And so it was really NFL, 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 NFL. Oh, there's some Rams sprinkled in. And I've always tried to not break away from the Rams, but expand. You know, I, I want to make sure, you know, I don't limit myself in any way. And so I dropped the John Wolford video. That got me 27,000 views over time. Uh, that was a, a huge money maker as far as uh, not just revenue, but like, you know, who came to my channel and actually subscribed. Um, people really like the Star Wars, uh, you know, theme of it. They thought that was clever. So, you know, that's what we did. And then after that, I did John Wolford winning a Super Bowl is not as crazy as you think. Uh, got 7K, um, which is really good. And the next one was John Wolford, not Jared Goff should start. I did that again with a Star Wars theme, uh, Empire Strikes Back, and that got 10K. And then I did one on Jared Goff versus John Wolford. It was a film breakdown showing things that Goff does uh, poorly. And, and, you know, Wolford did well and, you know, vice versa. Um, but I also at the end admitted that the Rams had two starting caliber quarterbacks. Um, that got 7K in the wild card weekend preview trying to, you know, again, I, I was focusing on the Rams, but then trying to get into the NFL you know, that type of deal. Um, and, you know, that did all right. And then the next one, Deshaun Watson news broke out and, you know, the Jalen Ramsey stuff going on about the Rams uh, potentially acquiring him. And so, you know, I dropped Deshaun Watson and the Rams is a dream that, you know, basically Les Snead could potentially make happen. That got 13K. Um, then Jared Goff returns and leads the Rams uh to leads the Rams past Seahawks in the return of the Jedi poster form that got 4.4 K. So not as much the coaching like, so I did a huge video that was an hour and 30 and it wasn't even a, a live stream. I don't think, but I did a, a huge video on the NFL uh, head coach in carousel. And I was told around January when this happened that YouTube promotes long form content and actually is looking for more long form content. But what I found is that when doing this, uh, it was not the case. I only got 143 views on a nearly, you know, two hour video. So the long form content wasn't hitting. And then I did a quick hitter on Sean McVay and how he changed the Rams fortune that got 2k, uh, views. And then the next one was cam Akers and defense East Seattle um, and, and you know, that was a film breakdown that got about three K next. I did Rams Packers divisional playoffs. That was after the Rams had already lost the Packers. It was a film breakdown. I only got 400 views. I don't expect too many people to watch an hour 23, uh, you know, video about how their team lost in the playoffs and, you know, their season's over, uh, the Trey Lance breakdown that got 1.6 K. Devlin Hodges repost interview got 2.4. Kurt Warner's repost interview got about 900. Isaac Bruce's repost interview got me about 250. 
Uh, the AJ show repost from the John Johnson news. I got 1.6. Um, Barry Bonds, Pete Rose talking about the Hall of Fame. That got me not even 150. Um, and then Leroy Irving got me 239. Repost of Dick Vermeil got me 320 or 724. Terrell Burgess interview got me 880. Super Bowl preview video, um, which was sponsored, got me 115. So as you guys can, you know, really gather here, the Carson Wentz video blew up and got me about 8K. Um, I really didn't have a direction for this channel. And if you look, I started getting more and more into the MCU, which wasn't really generating a ton of interest. I'm not going to stop because I just love talking about it. So, but, uh, you know, it wasn't getting a ton of interest. I did the Van Jefferson video, got me about 5,000 views. Um, and then that's when it really started to, you know, the consistency started to come. I think, uh, you know, last month was when you saw it, you know, you have, uh, over a thousand for the Rams on the clock, uh, video I made, um, close to a thousand who will they take over 3000, uh, you know, report card, draft report card. Um, and then 4,000. The Cynthia Freeland, 6,000. Tutu Atwell, 2,000. Cam Akers, 3,000. Daryl Henderson, 3,000. Stafford. Like, I don't know. This this projection series is doing really well. Everything is over at least 1,000 views, which was my aim. Um, some are even, you know, approaching 2,000, 3,000. Um, Higby is at 851. Donald just hit 1,000. Uh, Bash is at 820. Uh, Ashawn Robinson got over 2,000. The Cam Akers short, a 15-second highlight of a play, got me 7.5K views. Leonard Floyd, 896. And after that, it's Jalen Ramsey at 934. Darius Williams is almost at 1,000. Fuller's at 706 after one day, and Terrell Burgess is at. Let me upgrade, update this. Let's see if it ever loads. Terrell Burgess is at like 200. So, eh, 120. So, yeah, kind of goes to show you. Um,. It really does kind of go to show you, you know, guys, the reason I did that, not just to kill time, um, I'm always going to be up front if anybody is ever interested in getting into this. And, you know, you guys know I want to be a full-time YouTube content creator. Um, so, I mean, you it may feel weird early on. You may feel like things are all out of whack, all out of sorts. Like, my channel doesn't look beautiful as, the, you know, other channels do, and there's not really a focus but you know i'm seeing like the consistency when i do a rams video like the likes are there and likes are not i mean not likes uh views views aren't everything likes aren't everything but it helps because here's here's the thing okay when you are trying to you know continue your youtube channel you're continuing to grow and all that you do need a pick me up you need a boost from youtube you need a boost from the algorithm the best way to get a boost is engage. And so as you guys know, I engage with you guys uh, this way. YouTube doesn't really care. They're more focused on if you comment and all that. So that's why I always say, you know, comment, uh, you know, hit the like. Because that is what is going to ultimately push them uh, to the platform. Because so many people are now finding my channel out of nowhere. And it's because YouTube is recommending my channel because you wonderful people are watching my videos, liking my videos, commenting on my videos, and it tells YouTube, oh, okay, so a lot of people who like the Rams are liking this channel. And so that's why I'm getting more people. It's, you know, and that's how we're growing. And it, it's pretty awesome. And, you know, I look at us as like a community because all these people, you know, you guys, you find yourself in here. We're all just chilling in a live stream. Uh, you know, it's just, you know, really good time. And, um, you know, the discord channel and everything, it's a lot of fun, you know? So I just figured I would mention that while we were waiting. 
um if you guys want to know any statistics i mean you know we have a ton of returning viewers but i mean it you know on may 27th we had over six thousand new viewers hit the channel um so i mean i i love you know the unique viewers because that shows me that it's getting out to people that you know clearly just they haven't already been with the channel um so there's that you know i mean fifteen thousand new viewers in a week and it's not even close to the end of the week it's pretty cool so yeah you guys you know i owe it to you guys you guys have been awesome so i figured i'd share that with you and now finally end it so i mean we're pretty much almost at the 11 p.m deadline of when i wanted to get off but let's see how long madden takes and maybe i can pop in a game um let's see here there's no way okay i don't know if i do i need the full thing downloaded in order to play what i want to play oh okay yeah okay internet is fast here in case you guys didn't know this is not to showcase my internet speed by any stretch this is just wow you came in 21st nick how many kills you get it's definitely better than me today damn i stunk the joint up Wow, I can't believe how quick this is. <laughs> hey, man, two is better than nothing. And that's what I got three games out of four. So, is this like surprising anybody how quickly this is downloading? I mean, this is quick. Man. Twenty minutes. Yeah. Oh boy. Thank you, LA Rams. Appreciate you. Oh. Yeah. Me fighting my sleep. I see. EA Sports. It's in the game. Someone blew me out. Oh, 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 oh. It's caught. It's a touchdown. I can't give it to you by what they say. They've been 
And that's so annoying. I always forget to mute the mo like. I think it's total BS, by the way. I just got a point. Of course, play now. I think it's total BS that like you have to mute the the music in the game when you're streaming. Otherwise, it's a copyright claim. I, I don't I don't see how you get all of my video revenue for having a five second intro in my video because you're part of the video game I'm playing. That's just stupid. The more you know. Why is this the... <clears throat> the play now game. I don't even think I've played this yet. To be honest, I don't think I played much that wasn't considered the Rams. Like from Lambeau Field in Green Bay, Wisconsin. It's a special prime time edition of the NFL on EA Sports. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I'm gonna kick it off. takes the field their offensive leader of course Matt Ryan the former Boston College Eagle it's pretty much become the norm when we see guys come out before a game and go through the route tree with their receivers I thought it was exciting for us to see the all right I have no idea what uh difficulty this is on or anything so <clears throat> I'm just playing it's not just a one time a week thing they work on it all the time trying to hone that fine edge they want to see if they can get in sync and stay in sync in this one and he's not going anywhere to start the night. They stop him at the line of scrimmage. Call it no gain on the play, and it'll be second down. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> on second down, here's Ryan. Quick hitter here, it's complete. And he'll be out of bounds across the 30-yard line. And they'll get nine there. As that sets him Third up. and one. Nice. All right. Third down is a key down in any game you play. And third down defense, something we've got to watch in this one. Got to be effective. Not playing Warzone. That's a pretty good first step right there. And here's Hawk Richter now, the punter, as he sends this one away. 33 yards is the distance on the punt there. And it'll be Packer football here. First down and 10. Here we go with the Packer offense, guided by their decorated QB with a long list of Pro Bowls and other accolades next to his name, of course. Aaron Rodgers. There's the goat. And this could be a whole lot of fun because if his game plan goes into effect early, we're going to see some shots downfield, aren't we? What did he talk to us about? Stretching the field. Wants to open things up for not just his receivers, but for anything underneath. Well, that was the theme, the front page of the sports section. What did the columnist write? Possible air raid. So we'll see. Yeah, it's going to be interesting to see how the coaches view that, right? What? Who gave away the game plan? <laughs> I think it's pretty obvious, though. That'll help them win. Open on the left side. This is Valdez Scantling. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. Give him 11 yards and time and a new set of downs. On first down, Rodgers looking deep. It's caught at the 10. Well, that was easy. Devontae Adams, 46 yards. And the Packers have taken the early lead. For as big and strong as some of these guys are, especially when you see them in full pads, it is sometimes hard to appreciate how truly fast they can move. That was incredible. Now after the touchdown, here's Crosby to kick it away. Let's go, baby. Let's go. That's the way to make a play, kid. About 
and set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. And the first drive, three and out. Second possession, see if they can get a little momentum. And oftentimes that first drive is just a feeling out process. You have some plays. Going to be roughing the passer. Yep, of course. It may not go to the first one. Now they're ready to go. They've kind of got a look at them, got a sense. Let's see if they open things up a little bit. See if they open things up. Let's see what the defense does here, too, after a good stop. First and ten, it's Ryan. Toward the left sideline, but it's incomplete. What's the old adage? Be quick, but don't hurry. Now that went right out the window there. He was hurried, harassed. <laughs> so those of you who are still watching, we will be playing some Madden 22 when it comes out because I have the EA access. <clears throat> so, I mean, before it comes out, so stay tuned for that. I think it's going to be August. So we'll have some August uh, Madden streams on here. Out of the gun, it's Ryan. Airing it out, looking for Ridley. Oh, this what? Come on. And he takes it down deep into Green Bay territory. Probably because it's Calvin Ridley versus Shannon Sullivan. Down. Counting down toward the midway point in corner one. From the red zone now, here's Ryan on first down. That's complete to Smith. And he'll be out of bounds. I don't even think Edo Smith is still on the roster. It's just weird. And it'll be a second down. To throw again is Ryan. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. That one good for the completion percentage, but no gain. It'll be third down. They had the catch on second down, but it didn't help at all. And now they're looking at third down here. Ryan will throw again. Green Bay up to the task there in coverage and forcing a fourth down. It's a tried and true formula, and I don't think it'll change for as long as we play football. If someone's trying to throw the ball and you can put pressure on them and make it tough, that's only going to help your defense. Yeah, he's since being hurried. He got rid of it before taking the hit, but incomplete. So they've put together a good little drive there, but ultimately stalling out in the red zone. Yeah, I know a lot of people look at it as a little bit of a negative. They didn't get six points out of it, right? Didn't get the touch. Looking into the rain drops and he muffs it. Oh, my God. All right. It's annoying. The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. And they'll just simply be looking to build off the confidence of the last time out where they scored a touchdown. And confidence is powerful, isn't it? When you see That's right. Everybody runs in slow motion in this game. If that was real life, he's clearly running for something. This one complete to Devin Fulchus. And brought down, but not before they're able to get it up to the 25. Throwing on first down is Rodgers. Slant to Adams. Five yards Slant boy. I know that's uh, Michael Thomas. That's caught. It's Robert Tanya, the tight end. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. A good looking drive for the Packers. And the Falcons get there. The Falcons get the For guy takes 10 years to throw the football in this game. Davison breaking through to get him to the ground. It's a loss of seven. Back for the second quarter in Green Bay. It's the Packers in possession of the football. Adams hauling it in from Rodgers. And he'll work it across midfield inside the 45. A good looking drive for the Packers so far. It's a first down. Brandon, so many times we see the crossing route start as a quick hit. What? But in this play, he had time in the pocket and waited for him That's to clear name. going across. Devontae Adams, the intended receiver. And it's second down. Throwing again. Rodgers. He's going to go deep for five. And at the seven yard line, the catch is made. I was, I was very curious to see Funches in this uh, Packers offense, but he opted out due to COVID, so it'll be interesting this year. I think he's a potential sleeper, if I'm being honest with you. Traffic area, and he's able to work free in the middle of the end zone and grabs that one for a touchdown. 
down. So that drive consumes nine plays all told. And the result, a Green Bay score. Now after the touchdown, here's Crosby to kick it away. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. They trail now 14-3, an 11-point deficit as they start things out with a first and 10. And he'll do a nice job here just to fight his way back to the line of scrimmage. Officially no gain on the play, and it's second down. Defense doing their job, really nowhere to run the football. Yeah, it's almost textbook, wasn't it? Every place he tried to find an open spot, there just wasn't one. Congrats to the defense, no gain call fitting your gaps right I love it you're exactly right now Ryan on second down they'll set up the screen to Smith give him five on the screen play and that'll set up a third down for a second there I thought that might break big screen pass looked like it was coming together looked like there was an opening still ended up with a solid game they set up the screen. That's complete. And he goes out of bounds just shy of the 45. It's a pickup of 15 and a fresh set of downs. Let's give a little credit there. The offensive play call sends I might fast forward. Was available. Whenever you're getting a lot of heavy pressure towards your quarterback, that's when you're thinking about running the screen and using that pressure against the defense. Yeah, I'm going to fast forward. It worked very well there for a first down. And this is close. What? Okay. All right. That's cool. One quarter. And then we're calling the stream a wrap. <laughs> Appreciate everyone who tuned in. So the broken tackle didn't get him much. Two yards gets them back to where they started, but now third and ten. All right, that's oh, he slipped. There, but it hasn't been his best game overall. So I wonder what the mindset is of his team. Do they want him to handle the football and try and close this game out? Or are they going to make an alternative plan and maybe go in a different direction? I think they need him, and this is his time to shine. And he won't get much. Maybe a couple down inside the 35 to the 34. Off the play fake to Jones. Here's Rogers. They know that old expression. Uh, I hate that not animation. Not you know they're not going to catch it if it so goes into that animation. The legs are a little bit heavy. Sometimes having to hang out all day and play doesn't exactly play to your advantage, but it's been a tough go for him. Yeah, every time he looks up, somebody's there defensively. That was the same case on that play. It's a gain of 20 and picking up the first. Into the red zone. It's Rodgers. This will be caught just inside the 10. That he's brought down. Back to back nice gains. That one for 14 yards and another first. They fake the give. Now Rodgers. His throw in. That was such a Rodgers throw and he couldn't get his feet in bounds. And that'll bring up second down. Oh my god, can somebody get their feet in bounds? Jeez. Again, they'll throw with Rogers. And he's got it. It's there we go. Touchdown Funches. Devin Funches. His second touchdown of the night. And the Packers are able to stretch that lead out further. In order to lead in a game, you're going to get plenty of contributors. But that's his second touchdown catch of this game. 
And we'll be back tomorrow with another video for uh, Taylor Rapp. And then after, since we're putting out a video every day, you'll just have to stay tuned to see what I put out. set to begin their next drive the Falcons offense at the line and tough to win games if you're going field goal field goal field goal here they got field goal last time now they'll be looking for a touchdown uh, that was such bad coverage makes it that much harder puts more pressure on every possession for you now go ahead and get six and feel a lot more comfortable about the position they're in bigger chunks we'll see if they can get the score Now this one into the hands of the tight end, Hayden Hurst. Give him nine there on the first down completion. That last catch short of the marker by just a yard leaves him with a very manageable second and one. From the shotgun, Ryan. I'm sorry to hear that, Substance. I appreciate the warm words. I hope things get better for you. You know, you're my homie, so... <clears throat> Oh my god, what? Show the quarterback, there's no way. Not at all, and now your discipline comes into question. Having poise this stage of the game, you can't have those kind of plays. Looking left sideline, incomplete. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. to throw again Ryan and he's got his favorite target yet again it's complete and they do get him down but not before he's able to slip it inside the five man line. I can't believe how much this is hitting me nice pick up of 33 yards first and goal and they got to be thinking a chance to get right back into this football game so it's Falcon football as we welcome you thanks homie appreciate you first and goal as they look to punch in a yeah, I'll be I'll be on tomorrow night. Um, I have the stream with Blaine at eight, and then afterwards I'll play. No, I don't know what game I'll play, but I'll play you know a game or so. You too, my friend. You too. Have a good night. Awesome. Love to hear it. If they get the onside kick, I'm turning this game off. Yeah, I didn't think they were attempting it. Ooh. If that guy didn't miss his block, I'm gone. Uh, five viewers when I started streaming, like just the stream in general, or Madden, because I had it got up to ten at one point. I don't get that many gaming, um, Blackie Chan. I normally, what I'm looking at is, you know, I get a lot when I'm talking about football, but I don't get a ton gaming, and definitely not on a Wednesday. I feel like Wednesday is just a weird day. Analytically, it doesn't make any sense. No Wednesday is the same. Some Wednesdays, my views look good. Other Wednesdays, it doesn't. So, yeah. Now the defense will burn their third and final timeout. As they'll get it with just under 90 I'm not punting it back for the computer to screw me over. The computer will screw me over on fourth down. Got him 
Okay, it's in cool. It's a gain of 21 that time. And it'll give the Packers a first down. And he gets it down a yard or two shy of the 30 before he's out of bounds. Lock in the back. Oh, my God. So a decent gain, but the refs call everything in this game, I swear. Feeling pretty good about it. The only people celebrating, the guys who just gave up that play. Rogers to throw. I wasn't even paying attention. He's taken down. Tyler Davison, his second sack of the night. Back to throw. Rogers. A quick throw here. That's complete. And he'll get it inside the 40 to the 39. They'll wind up getting 10 back as that sets him up for third down. To throw is Rodgers. He's going to float this over the middle. And this is taken in at the five. And he takes it in for the score on the game. What? Final play, so it doesn't affect the, the glitch was so weird. Alright, guys. That's going to do it. I'm running on fumes, so figured I'd just finish that game. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in the stream tonight. I do really appreciate it. Um, we'll have the Taylor Rapp video tomorrow. Blaine Greasex coming on at 8 from Downtown Rams. And uh, we'll have a streaming, um, a gaming stream later on tonight. Or later on tomorrow night. All right? So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I appreciate you all. And I will be back tomorrow. You'll see plenty of me tomorrow. Uh, you guys take care. Have a great night. And uh, talk to you soon. So that's a wrap for Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gunn. And this has been a presentation of the NFL on EA Sports. For more, check us out at easports.com. The Packers are winners here as we say so long from Lambeau.